What do you like to do in the forest? I like to mountain bike. Mountain bike is good. Anything else? No. The favorite trail is bear buns. Nice. You get up to this place where when you look to your right, you see all the forest below you and you can see Cumberland and you can see all the places where it's not logged and where it is logged. One tree holds many spectacular little funguses, little animals. And some of the trees, you can see that there are like crevices. And in those crevices can live squirrels, frogs, birds. And if those, that was all destroyed, well, those things would all die. anything about what other people are doing to force in other parts of the world? Yeah, lots of people are doing good things. Help forests grow, um, do things to protect the animals in the forest and the trees and everything. People can, they like log forests and keep it only for logging and just grow it and log it. And other people just try to protect that from happening to other forests. What do you like about the forest? Well, I like the water and the streams and the water dropping from the trees. What kind of forest is this? It's a temperate rainforest. It's a Canadian rainforest. How do you think Cumberland would be different if the forest wasn't here anymore? Wow, when people were walking through the forest, they would be like strolling along, and suddenly there's this big, not forest part, and it would be really strange. Do you think that young people can make a difference and help protect the forest? I hope so. How? Well, maybe they can start a fundraiser, and, put, and they can get a whole bunch of people to help. What kind of things are other people in the world doing to help the forests, as far as you know? Well, as far as I know, I'm pretty sure that some other people are raising money. And then there's a few other people who, well, they're rebuilding forests. Like planting them? Yeah. What's your earliest memory of visiting the forest? It was probably when I was about seven that we first came to the forest and it was with um, my cousins. It was really cool seeing all the trees and the creeks and all the different plants that are here and we saw some deer. And... What are some of the things you like to do in the forest? Um, I like to go mountain biking and hiking and mushroom picking. How does this forest make life in Cumberland unique? This forest is unique because it is a second growth forest, so there's still a lot of the old stumps from when it was a first growth forest, I guess but it makes Cumberland unique because of the biking trails and all the different people we get from all over the world from this. Do you think it would be better to save the forest we have now or make it a clear cut and then replant it? Um, I think it would be better to save the forest we have right now because there's all the trees that have been growing for a long time that are really beautiful. A lot of the forests around the world, they have cut down and a lot of people are trying to regrow them and other people are trying to save their forests just like us. United Nations Sustainable Development Goal number 15 expects that we protect, restore, and promote sustainable use of terrestrial ecosystems, sustainably manage forests, 
combat desertification, halt and reverse land degradation, and halt biodiversity loss. The Cumberland Community Forest Society is a grassroots community organization dedicated to purchasing and protecting an at-risk mature coastal rainforest on Vancouver Island. In addition to its importance to the local community for education, recreation, heritage and conservation, this forest is part of a global network of forests that support biodiversity and mitigates the threat of climate change. <laughs>